Hello everybody, welcome back over here. We're gonna look at how you basically connect your S9 to you know just put your S9 online. Right? You put it on nice nice hash, which is a mining pool I'm gonna use today. So over here, this is uh, at the account when you just create a nice hash account, right? <coughs> So, I showed you a video where I basically um, create with the miner over there. I uh, show you how to set it up before any video on this channel. You find uh, one of those uh, how to set up your Bitcoin miner S9. And now, I want to focus on how you connect that to uh, the mining pool. So I'm using nice hash over here. So um, I got one wig connected over here. As you can see, it's uh, still running, right? And you see the mining uh, payment over there, you know, like, um, and which is like a few sats, um, like a thousand sats every, every payment. Um, and uh, the profitability is, uh, just like 96 cents every 24 hours it goes up and down right so it's a which is like about 3,000 uh, 3,000 sats 4,000 sats um, and uh, yeah so now let's go add a miner let's say you want to add a, a miner right first you put your miner on right you connect your miner to the ethernet cable right just like i show you uh you just you know there's a spot for either ethernet cable there's a spot for the power connection right you just plug it in and then you put the ethernet cable on and then uh, a few minutes after it start running and then what you do so since this mine is already running i uh, already connected it so you go find the uh, uh, your miner IP address, right? There's IP address. So I know mine. Um, I'm gonna just uh, put my IP address and then uh, put this on there. So it's all automatically go on the I at miner web over there uh, with the IP address. But first, in order before you get to this page, it will ask you at miner will ask you to put uh, when as soon as you put the IP address. Right, at miner will ask you to put a uh, password, right? The username and password. So, for username, first you're gonna put wood R O O T, right? And the password is also wood R O O T, right? So, before you get to this page, right? So, uh, this because I already just log in, right? And then, so it doesn't ask me that again, but I just want to make sure. Well, I just want you to know that it's gonna ask you that, right? So once this done, and you get on get to this page, and then uh, the most important uh, place you wanna go to is minor status, right? So you're just gonna go, go there. It's gonna show you the status. It's gonna show you basically how much you're hashing. Uh, this is the hashing about uh, thirteen thousand nine hundred uh, right now. It goes up and down. And I show you a bunch of a bunch of matrix. It's like how many blocks did I found yet? A zero block. Um, and then local network. Uh, you have local work. You have utility. Um, and uh, like a bunch of metrics, right? So, but the most important is the, your hash rate, right? So thirteen uh, thousand nine hundred giga hash per second. Okay, now uh, let's uh, and then you have the fan speed. Uh, there's two fans running over here, and yeah. So now let's go. Right. So this is just that, right? But how do you get it? Right? How do you get it? So first, um, I'm gonna show you how do you connect that to the uh, mining pool. Nice, nice hash. Right. So I'm gonna use nice hash. For this video so what you do basically you go on uh, you go there you know you just 
would if you want to add a miner right so you go on mining right so you click on mining over here so and then you have download a miner or add asset right so you just click on this and then uh you go down there that says connect your ASIC device right that ASIC ASIC and you click it down there you check which you, what is your miner is it uh, S9 S19 right whichever the miner you have right so this S19 Pole whichever one so this is S99 the one that's running I just click on it the one I want to connect right and then you put name the name can be anything. You could just put, let's say, a number one. Maybe this is the first miner, right? If it's a second one, you just put number two or something, right? It doesn't have to be so many uh, letters or numbers, right? You just put one, just to simplify everything. And then, and then you put the uh, hashing algorithm, SHA-256, and then just create you the, those addresses, right? So now, I'm going to use this it, the first thing that that's the most important the, the this is this right you copy this which is the url you copy the first url okay the second one doesn't matter much you just copy the first one and then you go there on the at minor web website and then you go on a minor configuration right and then you go on the url spot uh, and then you just paste it, right? You paste the one you just copied, there, right? The first URL here, and then you go paste it there, okay? And then second, what you do, you go in the bottom, right? In the bottom, and then you copy this, this over there, okay? The the last uh, username. The username over there, the one in the bottom. You copy it, right? As you can see, you remark something because you see work, worker number, worker name, one, right? Well, you, you put uh, it generate me the username. It it put the address first and then that one, okay? Because I put one there. If I put two there, it would generate me two. It would put, it would put one that two, okay? So you just simply copy it, right? And then you go paste it in the bottom in the worker worker name over there worker spot okay so this this is just the worker okay and then the password is just you know x right just say x you just put x right so it doesn't really matter much just x okay so once this is done yeah that's all done and you're done hey right? it's all done and then what you do you go there and then you say save and apply save and apply that's it so and then and then you you sit and wait to see how the miner miner what the miner do does right how it's doing and the hashing right so that's basically how you set up your mind so very easy and simple right so very very interesting very very important for you to uh, you know, do some mining. Let's say you want some heating in your house, right? So I connect this there. Um, this is the setup over here. You know, like you got, you need some heating. You at the same time you can make some money, right? So we want more people to mine uh, locally, so we can decentralize the mining network security. So we don't want like big centralized companies mining and to start sensor transaction, right? So there's gonna be an implementation that's gonna allow you as this miner, if you find a block to, you know, int introduce transactions, right? So it's way less likely for somebody to, for a big company to censor transaction. So um, just kind of waiting for this. Yeah, so more decentralization and uh, more incentives for people to mine locally and and the other thing is because of this advantage is you could use the heat right to warm your house right so very very amazing i wanted to show you this guys please if you like support this channel like 
share, comment, and then, yes, I will see you again in the next video. Bye, call.